biggest kid in fifth grade and you acting like the, the, the smallest one. I wonder what your mom looks like. Only on five, a St. Lucie County student says she was suspended this week for trying to defend a classmate. The 11 year old says she took a recording of her teacher allegedly bullying another student. East Channel 5's Megan McRoberts has more on why that student at Samuel Gaines Academy is now being punished. Megan? Well, Kelly, it seems anymore most students do bring a cell phone with them to school and they keep them with them while they're in the classroom. One student says she used her cell phone to record audio of what she says depicted her teacher bullying another student. She thought she was doing the right thing, but she says the school said her video was illegal. 11 year old Brianna Cooper has good grades and works hard at Samuel Gaines Academy in Fort Pierce, but a video on her phone got her suspended for five days. I thought I did the right thing. Brianna says one of her science teachers was being mean to a student, so she took out her cell phone and started recording what she says were threats by her teacher to a classmate. And don't let the science fool you. I will drop you. Yeah, right. You don't know me. That's all I'm telling you. So don't give me no look. Brianna says the teacher had been mean to students before. This time she wanted to prove it. You think that they would actually believe a student over a teacher? Biggest kid in fifth grade, and you acting like the, the, the smallest one. I wonder what your mom looks like. You don't speak to children, let alone your students, like that. Brianna says she turned the recording into a teacher wanting to defend her classmate, only to get called to the principal's office and suspended. The school telling her it was illegal to record a teacher without them knowing. I never had anybody tell me you cannot record. She thought she was doing a good thing. She's 11 years old. She doesn't know the law. Law enforcement says recording someone can be legal if there is not an expectation of privacy. In this case, Brianna's mother, Cassie Faulkner, says the school told her there is an expectation of privacy even in a large classroom. Faulkner worries her daughter's suspension sends the wrong message to other students. Pretty much saying to students is if you think anything is wrong, don't try and do anything about it. Now, Faulkner says she's also worried because she says her daughter is suspended during the day. She says kids at her school are prepping for the Florida Standards Assessment. We did reach out to the school district for a comment, but they say they have no comment right now as there is an open investigation. Reporting live, Megan McRoberts, WPTV News Channel 5. Tonight